Namaste, everyone. Uh, let us solve this problem, uh, which is based on Christoph's law. In the following circuit, find the current I. Uh, very simple. I is uh, located here. You are asked to find out this current I. So the easiest method is uh, replace these two batteries by a single battery and uh, then find out the current. That's all. So how to replace the two batteries by a single battery? You know, when the two cells are connected in parallel, the equivalent EMF is E equivalent is equal to E1 R2 plus E2 R1. Of course, they are sending the current in the uh, same direction to the external resistor. So there is no negative required in between here. It is plus uh, E1 R2 plus E2 R1 divided by R1 plus R2. And uh, R equivalent is uh, R1 R2 divided by R1 plus R2. So what is E equivalent? E equivalent is equal to E1 R2, 4 into 1, 4 into 1 plus this E2 R1, 2 into 1 divided by R1 plus R2, 1 plus 1, 2. So that becomes 6 by 2, that is 3 volt. So equivalent EMF is 3 volt. What is R equivalent? R equivalent is R1 R2 by R1 plus R2, that is 1 into 1 divided by 1 plus 1, 1 into 1 by 1 plus 1, that is equal to 1 by 2, that is 0. 0.50. So now if you replace this circuit by a simple circuit which contains a single battery and a single resistor. So it will be like this, a battery and uh, the resistor like this. This battery is uh, 3 volt, 0.5 ohm. Current will be flowing like this and the resistor is 7 ohm. So what is I? I is equal to E by R plus R. That implies I is equal to E. E is 3 volt. R plus R is uh, 7 plus 0.5. 7 plus 0.5. So that becomes 3 by 7.5. I will multiply and divide by 2 so that I don't have fractions in the denominator. I is equal to 6 by 15. I think I can divide it by 3. 3 twos are 3 fives are. So it is 0. 4 amperes. Simple problem. Thank you.